The aftermath still everywhere. There are tree limbs down. There's, of course, a hole in a roof now tarped up. And there are two homeowners still trying to comprehend just what they survived. Thank God nobody got hurt. That's the main thing. A quiet afternoon interrupted for Robert Huffman and his wife, Latondra. And all I heard was a boom. Boom, just a big loud sound. Boom, I thought it was the end of the world. Around lunchtime Wednesday, a 105 foot crane trimming trees in a neighbor's yard toppled onto the Huffman's roof. First I thought I was gonna come out and go see a tree to land up on the roof, but it was a crane. The Huffmans were unscathed, but the danger wasn't done as their living room ceiling started caving in. It was just, I know, I feel something like something's gonna come through and it's tough for us to get on out of there. And just moments after they did get out, this happened. Debris landed all over Huffman's favorite chair. Usually I come up out of the basement in the evening and I, and I sat in that room. Eventually, the crane owned by Purcell Tree and Crane Service was lifted from the house and somehow able to drive off. The Huffmans, meanwhile, are left with a mess. We just put this roof on there a few years ago. That's my retirement home. But even though part of that home is now crushed, their spirits are not. Things happen, you just never know what to expect. You know, from day to day, you don't know what's going to be next.